morning, beautiful people. Buenos días. We are at El Salto in Las Palmas, our second stop in uh, Panama. We couldn't sleep a lot because we are nervous. We are about to ship our Lucky Liu, our truck camper across the Darien Gap. Our home. From uh, the port of Colón, Manzanillo to Cartagena, Colombia. We are a little bit anxious, a little bit nervous, but we are preparing this since months, actually since uh, March. So it's a uh, lot of months. A lot of months. And we received the confirmation just uh, 10 days ago. We need to make the police inspection, we need to make the DIJ, a lot of documents. So we are heading to Panama City as soon as possible. Cheers. We parked like the Liu just here at the edge of the waterfalls. And look the amazing view. If you see here, you take a few steps and you are at the edge. Bad news guys, we are about to leave this incredible spot and the starter didn't start, so the car doesn't start. We had some problem in the past days, like there is a strange noise in the starter, but we fixed the starter a few months ago and everything is okay. Luca thinks that it's something inside but the problem now we are stuck here so and we are in a position sometimes we just need to move a little bit the car a little bit in a different position and we can start the car again but now we are completely stuck because you can see we cannot go forward we cannot go back it's really heavy and it's really heavy we try to move the car the truck but it's impossible. It's just the two of us. We are five tons. The ground, it's really soft because it rains. So we are creating a hole down there. Luca is creating a ramp. Every time it's like this. When you are nervous, when you need to head to a place, when you are in a rush, when you have a plan and you want to follow the plan this is what happens you need to stay calm you need to think that everything is gonna be all right otherwise you just freak out do you think we will move I don't know. I'm trying to lift uh, the back to see if we are able to go forward or... because we are in a dangerous position as well because we are at the edge so if we move in this direction, it's not the best. So we couldn't move. Uh, uh, the starter is not uh, uh, making the engine move. Uh, and uh, we changed the starter last year. The engine part where the start uh, goes on was really I uh, used uh okay. This is the noise. Okay, we need to find someone that And the uh, last time uh, we could move the car so the engine moves uh, and goes where the teeth is not broken uh, so the starter can um, can attach uh, and can move it uh, but now we cannot move the car to make that happen uh, so we are stuck here. We will go and ask for uh, some help. Okay, on the road we found uh, a man that is helping us.
es Vitali. Está mojado, no lo The ground is really wet. We try now to get a little bit more of distance. No, ce faremo mai? No, sono troppo pesati. Sí. Para ver si ya de repente hace algo y es que se va como en fly. No, sí, no, 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 no agarra él. La... Muchas gracias. Because I fast forward what you have done. Okay, so we moved the, the engine. We moved the engine from here. Now, Luca will show you where we moved the engine from here without moving the car because it was impossible to move the car Now we know how to do it Mr. Orlando helped us out our day He really saved us Literally saved our day Yes You know that day that you just want everything goes in the right direction and everything goes the opposite You just need to have faith and meet the right person at the right moment in the right place Luca and I we have learned something new if you don't move the car you can move the engine you have always something new to learn every day that's a great stuff people can always teach you something right babe yes I'm so happy so happy so happy so happy are you happy Luckily, you are you happy? Super happy! Let's go now. Good evening, everyone. We are in a weak mood. Our car has problems uh, starting. This is not a problem for us. The problem is that we have the shipping from Panama to Colombia in four days you have to give the keys of the car and they have to be able to start the car load the car on the boat unloaded from the boat and we will not be there we can't be there so we know how to start our, our truck even having these kind of problems but they don't and we don't know if we will be able to talk with the person that will turn on the car we don't know if uh, there will be different persons uh, in Panama, in Colombia, so this uh, makes us really anxious, really, really stressed. Uh. There is stress and there is anxiety just for the shipment. There is a big level of stress just without the problem of the truck, just for the shipment, because you need to prepare all the documentation, there is a lot of money going on just for shipping the, the truck across the Darien Gap. And we are shipping via Roro, so it's not in a container because we are too big for the container. Lucky you won't fit in the container, so we need to pay more. It's a really expensive border crossing. So anxiety plus anxiety plus stress. We are a little bit in a rush. We cross Central America. We cross seven borders in three weeks. We knew it, we knew it, we knew that was really an expedition, that we couldn't enjoy every place as much as we would. We just hope that we could speak with the right person. We have the police inspection, the DIJ inspection on Friday, so the day after tomorrow, and then we would just be there on Tuesday to give them the keys 
and the truck at the port at the harbor in Colon, Manzanillo on Tuesday morning at 9 a.m. It's hard because uh, we are leaving Lucky Liu and um, it's our house here in uh, this uh, continent. Yeah. <laughs> so without Lucky Liu, we have nothing here. So if uh, anything happens, uh, uh, it's a big problem, it's a big mess. Uh, our expedition uh, to Argentina um, has to be with Lucky Liu. So uh, we hope everything goes smooth. We can hardly sleep during the night. Uh, and uh, anyways, we got to this amazing beach here in Panama. It will be our last stop before heading to Panama City. The really interesting thing about this beach is that uh, the sand is black. But we will show you tomorrow morning because now the sun is going down and the light is going down with the sun, of course. So we will make a drone footage tomorrow morning and we will show you the beautiful sun, the beautiful color of the sun, this black. We arrived just for the sunset. Uh, we couldn't film it because uh, we had to walk on the beach and just uh, talk and yeah. relax because uh, our emotional situation uh, is really uh, extreme. Borderline, I would like to say. Sometimes you forgot to take a moment deeply breath and have a moment with your partner that it's really important to talk with each other and uh, relax a little bit and say okay you know everything's gonna be all right because I'm really positive we are always positive and everything's gonna be all right we try to be always <laughs> positive is that since we come back uh, and we start traveling uh, uh, Central America every day a problem came out uh, so one time was the car one time was the camera one time was the drone one time was the computer and the starter and the car now we have the propane tanks leaking both of them yeah we didn't show in the videos yeah. uh, but uh, we have this big it's leaking too much it's too much for you and well. uh, yeah we don't want to be like this uh, we don't want to be negative we don't want to show only a lot of bad stuff going on uh, so we try sometimes just to try to figure out uh, how to get out of that bad situation uh. for today is everything beautiful people we hope uh, you have a peaceful and beautiful day and we see you tomorrow morning see you in the morning buona notte ciao good night boom good morning everyone I still have the Morpheus look in my eyes. Didn't sleep so good. But I would like to show the black beach. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. Can I show our stuff drying there? I'll make a view of our clothes have while they're drying. <laughs> and this little dog has slept uh, all night under our truck. Still sleeping, nice and fresh down there. Good morning. Sarah. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Black said it's extremely hot, but it's beautiful to see. Our clothes have an amazing view, eh? So, what do you say if we have a walk on the beach? Yes, 
we have a walk on the beach and then we will go straight to Panama City find a spot for the night and tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. we should be at police to do the inspection let's go let's go